Hey, welcome back to American Travel Fund. This is Chuck, your headless host, and today we're going to take a look at Riverside Walk in Zion National Park. This is an easy 2.2 mile round trip trail. It's perfect for those looking to experience a little bit of Zion without seeing the whole thing at once, but it gives you a good idea of how beautiful this place is. Let's just get started. Your journey is going to begin at the Temple of Sinawaba. I'm going to have it on screen because I can't say it. It's the last stop on the Zion Canyon Scenic Drive. This will be the last time you get a chance to grab some water, restrooms, that sort of thing before your hike. You want to remember to check the weather because the trail is open year round and current conditions can change in this part of the country very quickly because the trail is open year round. So it might be closed due to ice or something to that effect. The Riverside Walk Trail follows the Serene Virgin River, offering stunning views of hanging gardens, towering sand cliffs, and much more. This is an easy hike just over a mile each way and is the closest trail to the Narrows without actually getting wet. Here you can take your time and enjoy the natural beauty around you. Like I said, you got the hanging gardens, which are definitely a must see. They have the running water seeping through the rocks itself that nourishes the plants. Uh, it's a sight to see, hanging from the, you know, how they just cling there and hang from the canyon walls. It's great. Also, while on the trail, take a look for the educational exhibits along the way. This is a great way to just understand how the canyon was formed through erosion and other natural processes, which I am not getting into because I'm not that guy. I'm sure there's a thousand other channels for that one. I just tell you where to go to see the stuff. And after about a quarter mile, the trail is no longer wheelchair accessible due to the steep grades and narrow paths. But don't worry, the trail is manageable for most hikers. If you prefer to stay dry, you can turn around here. Otherwise, this is where the adventure to the Narrows begins. The Riverside Walk is mostly flat, but be mindful of irregular paving and minor drop-offs. Hence why it's not exactly wheelchair accessible from the quarter mile point on. Uh, do you remember pets are not allowed on this trail? And while there is no activity fee for this, uh, there is a park entrance fee that does apply. And whether you're an avid hiker or just looking for a peaceful stroll, this is the perfect spot for everybody. I personally think it's a nice way to get just a little bit of taste of Zion National Park without having to go through everything. You only got a little time, this is a good spot. It's a perfect way to experience the majesty. Majestic, majestic. I think this trail is beautiful. This is a perfect way if you only have a little bit of time to experience Zion National Park. And if you've enjoyed this video, please be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more travel adventures. And as always, thank you for watching, and have fun, guys. Enjoy.